Hello viewers, welcome to Core for Any. Today we need to start this year the new playlist. Inside we need to create here the real time car trackings. We need to show Google Maps. Use this years. First of all, today we need to integrate here the Google Map inserts and to show here. And then after we need to create here the Node.js projects. Inside we need to develop here the socket IO as well as we need to create here the one code to joins for this uh, specific cars and to show all cars inside the one Google Maps and to show all cars one one place to another place to moving we need to showing here the directions as well as need to car rotations and smooth animations need to showing this here the this playlist one by one need to start here let's start how to write downs imports here the google map library we need to need this here and to explain this how to configure here the google maps and first of all so need to open here the plotters Pub devs and to find out here the Google Maps 2.7 new versions we need to add here. Now we need to install this here the plugins. Now we need to copy here and we need to go inside the pub space and to paste this here. First of all, we need to find out here the dependency inside. Now we need to give this here the library and we need to save here and automatically get this here the package and also need to need this here the some configurations are the needs inside the redeem. First of all, we need to making enable here the Google Maps. This platform so we need to enable. Now we need to go and to enable this here the service. We need to enable here the Android and also need to enable here the iOS SDK. Also iOS need to make sure here the enables. And now we need to create first of all the key. Now we need to go inside the credentials and to create here the new keys. Air credentials API key you need to create here. Now need to first of all the go inside the Androids need to find out here the bundle ID. Need to find here. Now need to copy this bundle like this API. Need to create and close. Now need to restrict this here for the Androids. Need to get set here the name real time. Android and we need to set here the Android apps and to set here the package names like this we need to restrict copy here and we need to open here the redeems and we need to find out this here the mini paste inside we need to give this here the meta for this key we need to set here the value now we need to copy here and we need to go inside the android folders select here the main many paste and we need to set here the meta and now need to set this here the copy this key for the androids and real times like the sets uh, maybe need to copy this key wrong copy paste here like this sets here and sss once we need to find over here so here first of all now need to go inside the android folders you need to open inside the terminals give this here the android path and to run this here the signed reports and then after we need to show this here the reports now evaluate here the signed reports here installing first of all the if not installing the gradles then first of all installs and then automatically create this here the SSS once key and to put inside the restrictions. Now this is the like this reportings are the generating here. Now need to find out here the debugs if release then to use this here the release. Now need to put this here the key. Now need to copy the science reports and we need to go inside the gradles and we need to set here the restrictions. We need to add this here the bringer prints and to 
set here the duns and also need to save this here now this key are the restrict only this bundle id and this fingerprints only work this and like this need to configure here same as now need to create for the ios now need to create here the new api key like this create and now need to open this here the ios package need to open here open with x code now open here this ios and now need to find out here sign in and to copy this here the bundles need to copy here and we need to paste inside close this here open this here open this key and to set here the real time ios key like this write down here restrict here the ios need to add here give this here the bundle id and to set here the duns and to save and apply now copy this here the key for ios show key copy and to close like this restrict and we need to android now need to find out here the class of the app delegates and to first of all so need to paste here like this sets and we need to open this here the code in flutter and we need to go directory and to find out here the ship ui class we need to import this here the first of all the google map like this sets and then after we need to pop here and we need to paste this here and also cut here and set this here like this key inside him to save and to set android inside many paste inside to configure and ios inside the app delicate inside the configurations are the needs here and to configure for the google maps like this configurations needs after the opening here the google maps otherwise not loads inside the ui only showing here the white screens now need to go inside the lips and first of all need to making here the one demo creates here the new fold new folders and to give this here the name as a screen like this set and now need to create here the map screen to set here the small case map underscore screen dot ducks now rename this here the folder name screen like this and now need to go and first of all need to create here the stateful widgets map screen like this write down here and to import here material dependency redeem here scroll downs and we need to find out here the stateful widgets inside now we need to copy this here controllers static camera like this copy and to paste here and imports Let's also make sure we need to check here output required sdk versions maybe fix this here issue or zero save here and also make sure updates here the cutter up to date it to needs here the upgrades now here the package are installing guns for the google map guns now we need to import here the google maps controllers 
like here showing here after like the settings and again so you need to go inside the google maps and need to redeems and to put this codes for the loading here scaffold copy here return this scaffold and on press help friends write down CS like this and to shut this years now need to run inside the iOS first of all and make sure you need to set here the Android minimum versions we need to set here the 20 first of all you need to fix this years go inside the Android bundles and we need to find out here the minimum targets we need to set here the 24 like your save and we need to change this here the ios development target also need to change go inside here and we need to set here the 14 and open here in our xcode and we need to change this here the target set here the and close this here and again so we need to run here now buildings here the running ports installings if successfully then to run these apps inside the simulators now xcode build are the buildings here for installing done and now waiting for the load inside the simulator these apps run and to show this here the google map now opening here the simulators and to installing this here the apps and we need to also configure this here the google map screens we need to forget here we need to remove this here the home screen no needs now we need to clean here and we need to change this here the home as a we need to set this here map screen and set here the const value save here what reloads and to look like this here the showing here the google map loads are the done here and displaying here also need to disable here debug labels need to set here the pulse like this like this showing here the google maps run these apps inside the androids now need to test get any errors or not need to check this here first of all now android app apk need to build here and to show this here map are loadings because need to set here the restrictions that to only showing this map here same as need to follow this configuration step otherwise not load here the maps and tomorrow need to see this here the node.js project setups need to sets and also need to configure this here the socket io inside the node.js and then after we need to continue here the mobile apps need to some course for the socket io need to write down like this need to complete real time car tracking systems need to demo need to ready inside the with connections here the plotters as well as need to connect with here the node.js sockets and to real time configuration so need to set here the real times are moving same as need to move and roads and like the ubers hola like this we need to moving here the same with the smooth animations if you like this video please give the thumbs up if you're new user so please subscribe my channels and press the notification bell icon you can get every new video notifications and awesome content if you have any questions so please write down the comment sections i will help you and sort out your issue every and have a nice day goodbye and take care